with O's marketing team. Today I wanted to go over the difference between the two types of defects that we might find in a property. So a defect is an imperfection or shortcoming in either the quality or condition of a building or property. So the two main types that we deal with are a patent defect or a latent defect, sometimes known as a material latent defect. So the first one, a patent defect, is something that you could see if you did a reasonable inspection of the property. So that would be something like um, there's a cracked window or there's some gaps in the hardwood floor, um, a door handle is broken off, something that if you did a reasonable inspection of the property, you would be able to see it. So the second type, the latent defect, is something that is hidden and you would not be able to see it if you did a reasonable inspection of the property. So this would be something like known asbestos in the building or a buried underground oil tank, something that you would not be able to find unless you did like a very invasive property inspection or somebody told you that it was there. Um, so that brings me to the disclosure portion of material latent defects. So if a seller is aware that the property has a latent defect on it, they are legally required to disclose that to any prospective purchasers. So if you are unsure what type of defect your property might have, or if there are any, it's always a really good conversation to have with your realtor to determine if it's something that needs to be disclosed or remedied prior to selling your home. If you have any questions, please reach out and thank you for watching.